I'm Ms. Artastic and this is a drawing with littles video perfect for the young artists and in this episode we are going to be exploring the letter C and C is for cow. Cow starts with the letter C. So we're going to draw a cow and explore the letter C. So grab something to draw with and something to color with and let's explore the letter C for cow. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, so we're going to draw a lovely, super cute cow. Yes, a cow. Let's do it. All right, we're going to begin cow with a curving line. And this is a drawing for Little's video. So if you are a beginner artist or a young artist, this is the perfect video to get you started in drawing. And of course, today's letter is C. C is for cow. It's also for cat. What else is it for? Lots of different words. Crayon and color. And today, we are focusing on cow. C-O-W spells cow. All right, two U shapes where we're gonna put the horns. And then we can draw two lines up and back down. Just below the horns, we're gonna draw a curving line over. back in. We'll draw one more line at the top for the fold of the ear. All right, we're gonna draw two curving lines down. Then we're gonna draw the cow's nose with a big curve at the bottom. We're gonna continue it up and over into the middle. Another curved line to meet there as well. We'll give the cow a little mouth and draw two big cow nostrils. And on either side of the face, we're going to draw a circle for cow's eyes. In each circle, we're gonna draw one big circle and one small circle. Then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the eyes, leaving those circles nice and white. I'm gonna add some spots on the head. You can add some spots as well. All right, I'm gonna draw two U shapes for the front legs. And two for the back at the bottom. Kind of like, almost like a rectangular shape. We're gonna have our cow kind of sitting on the ground. We're gonna draw one curving line from that mouth down to the back leg on the one side and on the other side as well. Then you can connect the bottom with one straight line. Mm -hmm. 
can color in the hooves. And I like to give my cow a nice little tail here with two lines. And then you can add some zigzag lines at the tip, make a little fluffy tail. You can add some more spots on your cow. Mine's gonna be a dairy cow, so I'm gonna add some little spotties there. Then you can go ahead and color in your spots, leaving the rest white. Or if you want to make it a brown cow or a different colored cow, you can color your cow, whatever cow color there that you want to make it. The cows actually come in lots of different colors, so you can check out once. If you have a Brahmin, it might be a beige or a gray. It's all kinds of different cows. So you make the cow the color that you might see in your local area. That's the best thing to do. Or if you want to try and draw a dairy cow, hey, that's cool too. Once you're done coloring in your cow, your artwork is done. And of course, cow starts with the letter C. And we draw C, uppercase C, with the big line that curves up, around, and down, then back up again. And the lowercase letter C, just one smaller curve. It's like the big one, just half the size, just smaller big or uppercase C and lowercase C and that spells cow. C is the first letter in cow, then O and W. C O W spe spells cow. O W says ow and then if we add the C in the front it says k k ow k ow cow. Cow starts with the letter C. And once you're done, your lovely artwork is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So tag me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic and I will check it out that way as well. And you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode, and I will see you in the next.